Hey guys, um, I'm gonna be showing you how to do an NEC plugin. So, here we go. We're gonna go to the website. Now we are going to download version 1.0. Legacy source right now in our CSV. Now that we have those in there. to move the folders into the C strike folder. Okay. Now we're going to go to the CFG folder. And you guys are going to be putting Exact Nanny Server at CFG and Exact Nanny Quick Sounds at CFG. Next, we are going to go to an add ons folder and create a VDF file. We're going to go to game type C strike with VR Gaming CSS. VDF into the add ons folder. Okay. Now we're going to move on to Quake Sounds. Since that is done, Quake Sounds, save file. Same thing, we're going to move the CFG sound file to the C strike folder. Now we are going to go into the CFG folder again. Nanny Quake Sounds. We're going to change this to 1. And we're going to copy and paste this. Oh no, we don't have to copy and paste it, sorry. Save changes. Go to the menu server at CFG. We're going to go find and then sound. Now we're going to search for make sure Nanny Sounds Auto Download is on. And we're going to set that to 1 because what that means is if someone uses admin sounds and they try to abuse it, they can only do one sound until that sound finishes so it doesn't overlap. So now they have sounds on there as well as you know, fire or whatever. They don't have fire, 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 blah, 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 blah. So we also probably want an admin sound. I don't know why people don't do this, but this is so easy to do this. Do this. This is the old fashioned way. What you do is add a steam ID. Etc. You know what I mean. You know? Add your steam ID into that. You want to add an admin list.txt folder. Any file right into your nanny admin plugin folder, and then you'll have admin, unlimited admin on that. I don't know why people make clients.txt, it's just, I think it's just a burden. That's just me because I'm old fashioned with admin. Okay, and there you have it. Now 
we are going to go to the game types config, save and file. Because we have to update it. Because sometimes there's errors in other games, so. Put the game types file, open containing folder, and we're going to go drag and drop it to C strike folder. And there we go. Hope you enjoyed the documentation on the tutorial on Manny Adam.